Hello, this is Steve at GreenFuelHO.com. Today I'm going to show you how to calibrate a pH and ORP meter. This meter I just got, so we have to do a calibration to make sure it's accurate. And what we do, how we accomplish that is we use some solution that's already pre calibrated. This is a a pH of 7 and for the ORP this is a plus 400 millivolt calibrated solution. Um, I've used these before and when I, I put the uh, solution in these bottles so we'll go ahead and use those. What I want to do first is the, uh, the pH solution no. Go ahead and get that ready. I think the easiest way to do it is put it in this cup and we will pour the contents back into the package. Turn on our meter. How you calibrate these is uh, up here. Got two potentiometers that you can turn to calibrate them. I'll see if I can get this down into the solution here. See settling seven point zero six right now. And according to this, um, temperature is fifty seven degrees. I should be at about 7.06. Showing 7 right now. So I will adjust this. To 7. Zero six. You can see it's at seven point zero six, and that's considered calibrated. Go ahead and wash this off in some distilled water. And pour this regent back into the container so I could use it next time. All right, next I'll do the ORP. We'll do this the same way. Take the 400 millivolt solution, pour it into the packet here. Okay, we'll switch our meter over to the ORP scale. Stick it down into the solution. Uh, 
at uh, four negative oh I'm sorry it's positive 400 millivolt so we're at positive 400 right now we'll let it settle down Okay, we'll turn this down to 400 millivolts. Okay, we've got 400 right there. And that's considered calibrated. Now when I use my meter to test the RP value or pH, I'll have an accurate meter. Hope this helped everyone. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. I'll be sure to try and answer all of them. This is Steve. Thanks for watching.